Folks, neighborhood dummy, back with another one. This is the same pinky that the grinder with the chainsaw disc got. If you hadn't seen that video, I'll put it in the description below. But September of 2020, I let a grinder get away from me, the one with the chainsaw thing on it, and it ate, it opened this finger up. I don't know, from about this knuckle to that knuckle. Anyway, same pinky, different piece of equipment, two and a half years later. I mean, what can you say? Some of us are slow learners, okay? Some of us just, just don't get it. We just don't get it. Let me carry you up there to the shop and show you exactly what happened. All right, folks, here's what happened. A lot of you more experienced woodworkers can see what's wrong right off the bat. But this is the piece of wood I was cutting. And I was just cutting it here. I was going to flip it and cut it here to make a stake just to drive in the ground. And, uh, well, what happened? Let me get around here. I was feeding the piece of wood through. Basically, you could tell from where it happened at what happened. I was feeding the piece of wood through. Hand was in the wrong spot. And it, it just went straight through. And my hand went up and got in the blade. Now, the first thing I got wrong, when you're cutting a piece of wood this thick, you should only have about that much blade exposed. Look how much blade I have exposed. Here's what it should look like. That's about where it should be. So if I was cutting and I hit right here, nothing's going to happen. So I guess uh, lessons learned, don't get complacent, don't get in a hurry. So don't get complacent, don't leave too much blade exposed, and don't get in a hurry. Same thing goes with a table saw. If you're cutting with a table saw and you're cutting a, a, a one-inch board, your table saw blade should be sticking up above that board just enough to cut it. That way, if you do run your hand across there, you're looking at a tiny cut rather than a finger gone cut. Anyway, you know what I'm saying. Y'all have a good one. Take care. We'll see you on the next one.